Hi, my name is Ashley Griffin, and today I will be discussing what hyperneomyasis is. To begin, there's some basic information that you will need to know. The first thing is that hyperneomyasis is a type of wound that is found externally on horses. These wounds are also known as summer sores, jack sores, and have several other names. These wounds are caused by parasites known as habernema or dystrachia. Parasites are part of the parasitic relationship in which the parasite lives off of its host. In this case, the parasite lives off of the horse. The habernema or dystrachia parasites are found within the stomach lining of the horse, and as part of its life cycle, the larvae of these worms are passed into the feces of the horse. By leaving the body of the horse, these larvae are then ingested by flies, and the flies carry the larvae back to the horse's mouth for the horse to ingest them and continue on the life cycle. With the case of summer source, the life cycle becomes a barren, which means it goes off the regular track, and instead of the horse ingesting the larvae, the flies carry the larvae onto open wounds or mucous membranes of the horse. This aberrant track is what causes the wounds. These wounds become infected and have granulated tissue. Most of the time, they occur on the inner corner of the horse's mouth, lower legs, on the sheath, or on the inner corner of their eyes. Once the wound has been properly identified as a summer sore, treatment is necessary. One of the first recommendations is to deworm the horse using ivermectin. This kills the stomach worms and helps kill the larvae that are present in the wounds. For treating the wound, an antibiotic ointment containing steroid is also recommended. The steroid aids in reducing inflammation, and the antibiotic helps with infection. The most important thing is to cover the wound so that the flies cannot get to it to track more parasites or cause more irritation. If the wound is severe enough, surgery may be required. These wounds mostly occur during times of high activity of flies, which is usually during the summer. This problem can reoccur yearly and not every horse will be affected. It is important for horse owners to have a general understanding in case their horse becomes infected. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed my video.